uh, two days of this year uh, that we're going to be re doing a review for chapter three and chapter seven chapter eight uh, this only those two days we're going to be dividing the subjects of the three chapters on two days so the first day is going to be chapter three using functions uh, to model relationships so we're going to be talking about understanding relation and functions. remember this is only it's going to be a review uh, so uh, something all going to be similar you know to what we did before and you guys are going to be familiar with it so we're going to talk about understanding the relation and the function so the difference between relation and function uh, then connect representations of functions uh, we're going to be talking about comparing linear and nonlinear functions and also we're going to be talking about construction functions to model linear relationship we're not going to be talking about chapter 3 5 and 3 6 those are being omitted so it's not going to be on the final exam uh, increase and decrease and this one so we, we took them out so just took it down on material for the final exam uh, so chapter three this is going to be like this and then we're going to go to the next book which is the volume two volume two has chapter seven and eight in it okay so also chapter seven we're going to do all four sections we just took one out okay so we're going to be doing um, uh, the chapter seven which is understanding and applying Pythagorean theorem so uh, first of all we're going to understand what's a Pythagorean remember you guys uh, we talked about in class uh, when you have a 90 degree triangle we use Pythagorean for example to find the hypotenuse or the legs of the, the triangle also we're going to be talking about something called the understanding uh, understanding the converse of Pythagorean so for example if I give you numbers and I'm going to ask you if this is this a 90 degree triangle by using Pythagorean you could prove that if it's yes this triangle is a 90 degree triangle or not uh, chapter 7.3 we're going to skip so applying the Pythagorean theorem to solve problems and then the last thing we're going to be doing distance uh, finding distance of the, the, the coordinates so distance formula it's also part of Pythagorean uh, now the last chapter we're going to be doing is we, we're going to be talking about the, the surface area and the volume of uh, four shapes um, we're going to be talking about uh, the three dimensional figures we're going to be talking about cylinder we're going to be talking about cones and and spheres so um, section 8 1 we're going to talk about the surface area of uh, three dimensions section 2 is going to be talking about the volume of the cylinder section 3 is going to be talking about the volume of the cone section 4 is going to be talking about the volume of sphere so section 1 has all this all the dimensions uh, everything has to do with the sphere or the cylinder or the, the cone and the other ones are only specialized for the volume uh, of uh, the, the cylinder cone and, and sphere okay and that's what that will be it and that's will be our review week okay guys talk to you later goodbye